Hello everybody, it's been a long time, um, I think the last video I put out before New Year so I've decided to put a little video together, I've had a tremendous weekend at um, Bingley Hall with, uh, with my fellow mini YouTube friends and uh, I'll show you, I didn't take any video while I was there but I've got some pictures so I'm going to show you those and I'm going to show you why I've not been very busy um, working on the mini there is stuff that needs to be done but I've uh, been trying to get a bit fitter so a few things I bought uh, at Bingley I'll show you first um, I didn't really need a great deal um, I found this time at Bingley Hall because it was my first time going there and not having a list of stuff I really desperately needed I didn't, uh, I didn't really enjoy the auto jumble so much and didn't spend so much time in there although I'm sure my son thinks I spent too long in there but um, yeah I just bought a couple of bits and pieces I'll stick a photo in because I don't think I'll get around the front but I've changed the front number plate on the Mini with one I got off, uh, off the internet and uh, I shall show you in one moment what else I got I've got I've got uh, some new number plates for the car um, I only need one of those because I've put a uh, put a stick on one as hopefully you've seen the picture on the front so I'm going to stick one of these on the back um, and also one moment I've got a pair of A panels um, I want to redo the front end on the car I'm not entirely satisfied with how it fits it's um, it, it's uh, I've not put the A panels on very well uh, which has made the doors very difficult to line up in order for them to um, sit correctly on the front edge it puts the back edge out so I'm planning on changing the A panels but I'm also tempted to go with a full metal proper front end do the inner wings and the wings and front panel um, but it's quite expensive to buy all those panels in one go to uh, to do that so I'm thinking as just taking my time and getting a few panels every now and then and build it up and then hopefully towards this summer, end of the summer I'll have all the necessary bits to put a proper front end on it I am still going to use the fiberglass bonnet I've got because I quite like that, I like the look of it um, but yeah, so the A panels are the start I'm either just going to put them on and use those to realign the whole fiberglass front or I'll wait and get, uh, get the metal panels let me know what you think, if you think I should fit those and do the fiberglass front again make it fit better or whether I should wait and get all the other bits and pieces I've also got a new uh, a new sticker probably can't see what it says classic mini workshop got that from uh, from Keith so I'm gonna put that on this window here might be a bit dark you can't see it very well but that's uh, obviously my sticker window so I might put it don't know. I'll stick that on and then I'll show you. I'm not very good at all at stickers, but there we go. Classic mini workshop. Lovely. Right, on to the excuses. So, excuses time. I'm doing this bit of video with my phone just because. I can put it in my gimbal and hold it a bit more, uh, bit more steady. Um, since the beginning of the year, I decided I need to get myself a bit fitter, lose a bit of weight. Five or six years ago, I used to do quite a lot of cycling, and um, I, I was about three to three and a half stone lighter. Um, so I really, really want to get back to how I was. So. I've been spending a lot of evenings like I'm spending this evening mm -hmm. um, inside the house on my uh, bike um, I'll just turn the camera around and show you you may not be the slightest bit interested but I've got my bike set up inside uh, see if I can turn this around to let me see if I can do it to show you so if I just turn the camera around this way tilt it you can see I've got, let me have a go, better go at this. I would see the cars there. Oh, working out the controls. 
got my bike on a smart trainer down there which I bought myself recently it hooks up to uh, a program I'm running on the computer so for those that aren't familiar that's me on the screen there my smart trainers hooked up to it I can ride with many other people I've also got a heart rate monitor and speed and cadence sensor on the bike so it can measure the power I'm producing and uh, vary the, the smart training varies the resistance according to the terrain on the screen I've got a guy just coming up on the side of me here so yeah I've been using this because it's very dark and very cold in the evenings at the moment I don't really want to be out on the road in those conditions so I'm going to save me road rides for the weekend. I'm trying to target 100 miles a week on my bike. Um, I'm doing most of those indoors at the moment, but uh, yeah, I've not made 100 yet. But I've already doubled my mileage from last year, what I've done this year, so things are looking up. Starting to get a bit out of breath, starting to go uphill. Um, most of you are probably not interested, but I thought I'd share with you what I'm doing. I've already lost, started out the year at £203. I'm now down to 192.5, so making slow progress. If you're interested in following my progress, I'll uh, include it in my next update. If you're not, I won't bother. So now I'm just going to show you what my, all my pictures from Bingley Hall and uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy them. Let me know in the comments if you spot your car or uh, spot yourself and uh, thanks again for watching. Now I've learned to never help you out